We have all sat inside of a classroom and listened to a teacher give a presentation on the topic of the day. While this is certainly an important part of the educational process, there is nothing like hands-on experience to deepen the learning and the understanding. That's exactly what is happening in the Outdoor Learning Lab at West Claremont High School. In the summer, we applied for a grant to uh, study the stream that's here on the West Claremont High School property. We're pretty lucky to have a small stream that runs by here. It seemed like a great opportunity for our freshmen to actually do science instead of just learn about it. So we uh, received the grant, bought some of the equipment we needed, and now once every two weeks we come out and sample the stream. Located just down the hill from the tennis courts on the West Claremont High School campus, students are able to head down to the Outdoor Learning Lab and conduct real-world experiments thanks in part to a grant from the Martha Holdens Jennings Foundation. These experiments allow our students to take their learning beyond the brick-and-mortar walls of the high school. Take a look at things such as the, uh, the water quality, dissolved oxygen, how high the stream is, how fast it's moving, take a look for any critters that are in it, fish and those kind of things, and uh, then we go back the next day, do some other water quality analysis, and then talk about our observations. I feel like I learned how to actually do hands-on projects better because when you're in a class and you're sitting down and like working with a partner or two on a paper that's not really hands-on activity but going outside and actually taking your own water samples and analyzing your own data and all that it's just it's good to learn and getting the hands-on work they get in the outdoor learning lab is another way our students are getting valuable experience in becoming career college and life ready. I think that's so important, particularly in, in, you know, in science where uh, we talk about the outside, we talk about processes, things that are happening. But if you're just getting it from a textbook or a PowerPoint, it's not the same as being out here. And It's a chilly morning and students sometimes uh, complain about coming out, but I think once they're out there, they really get into what we're doing and get a good sense for what science really is all about. 